Hey, my name is Andrew Snyder, and I'm the Ultimate Mountaineer fan. This is my man cave right here. Uh, we currently live in Alabama. Um, moved all around just because the military got me where I needed to. Uh, so I try to catch as many games as, as I can on the road. Uh, this is my man cave. All right, so <clears throat> over here, got some license plates that were on my vehicles, some pendants I got. I got that at the, the Big 12 ba baseball tournament in Oklahoma City. Uh, got this at a West Virginia basketball game. Um, the border around these doors right here, they're actually from the West Virginia University vault book, but they're, they're old, like ticket, stubs or the postcards from each bowl game or special events um, so they're pretty cool it's pretty special to me uh, right here is really special I have great in-laws so my wife's my wife's grandfather he painted these back in the day this is Randolph County with an elk and up here well everybody knows what this is it's the New River Gorge Bridge it's awesome so shout out to them. And I got this cool tiki piece down here in Alabama. I was pretty surprised the sports store had it. Uh, it's a pretty cool piece. You know, grandparents always send stuff like West Virginia Cokes. My father-in-law gave me this hat. It's a pretty cool hat. He had stitched on 304. Got the state on there. Uh, you know, got the man cave, obviously. My wife made me this cup, which is pretty special. It's got our anniversary date on it, but she got it just for the man cave. There's a picture of my wife and a couple kids of ours. And then, uh, of course, the legend, Bob Huggins. And I got him with the court. He gave some money to the Norma May Huggins Foundation. Uh, I got one of my favorite players up there, Bruce Irvin. He's one of the best D-linemen we've ever had in Morgantown. Probably one of the most special pieces in this man cave right here. Got this helmet right here. Signed by Steve Slayton, Mario Alford. You got Clint Trickett, Shaquille Riddick, Nick Kwiatkowski, Carl Joseph, uh, KJ Dillon, Kevin White, Pat White, and Quentin Spain. I'll put the blue visor on it, of course. But it's a, it's a real helmet. It's not a replica. Uh, it doesn't have the comfortable padding in it like the players wear, but you could still wear it. Now I've got the foam finger, the mini helmet. Uh, awesome picture right here. It's uh, Pat White, you know, against Louisville, 2008. Signed by Mr. Patrick White himself. Uh, got these, these awesome official West Virginia toddler chairs down here. Because I have uh, three children that are three and under. Uh, Three-year-old son, Braylon, and my two-year-old daughter, Caroline. And uh, this is where they sit when we watch games. So I'll try to get them to sit. They're everywhere. Got my beautiful wife right here by the Coal Rock up there, you know, where they do the man trip. You know, got the couch with the West Virginia blankets on it. You know, great state flag up here. Got a West Virginia flag. Got some cool pictures over here I'll show everybody. So right here, it's me with Nick Kwiatkowski, Carl Joseph, and KJ Dillon. Second picture is my wife and her father. And then next picture, we got myself, Mario Walford, Kevin White, Clint Trickett. And then last but not least, you got uh, myself, Steve Slayton, and Patrick White. And then uh, got a pretty cool West Virginia up there. Uh, this was a gift for me. This is pretty cool. This was made out of, uh, this was like a chalk type of paint. Uh, it's pretty cool. And then got a awesome, you know, country style sign right there my grandmother gave me. And then here we got the, the West Virginia Fathead. Of course, it's a stadium from the Big East days. So it's pretty cool. Lots of good memories when we were in the Big East. About to make some new ones with our awesome new head coach. We got the, uh, the wide photo from the inaugural Big 12 football game where we toppled Baylor 70 to 30, 70 to 63. Uh, never forget that game. Geno Smith threw for seven touchdowns, right? I'm pretty sure. 
Uh, got some Mountaineer all time greats right here. You know, our, I mean, some of these are arguably the best players we've ever had. Sam Huff, probably the best player we ever had. Uh, Geno Smith, Steve Slayton, Tavon Austin, Mark Bulger. There's more than that, but that's this cool sign. Got this awesome picture. Bob, signed by Bob Huggins up there. Uh, you know, got the TV and the the West Virginia flag. And uh, over here we got the most, probably the most dynamic player we ever had at West Virginia, all purpose wise. Uh, Tavon Austin. Um, right here we got this picture where Tavon Austin and Stedman Bailey were, you know, they were dapping it up. And uh, it's signed by Stedman Bailey and Tavon Austin, too. Right here, arguably the greatest quarterback West Virginia ever had. Yeah. I'd say it's a very close race between Pat White and Major Harris. Major Harris signed this right there. And uh, we also have a signature from Reggie Rimber where he had uh, – 1,366 yards and 18 touchdowns. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Uh, we got the rug down here when you walk in. So, you know, I just, I like to make sure I feel at home. You know, I've been away from home for almost five years now. So, uh, you know, just miss it. But I take it with me everywhere I go because West Virginia is always in my heart. Uh, also, this tattoo I got, it's a, uh, I got like a path leading through the woods. It's a uh, country roads, you know, almost heaven. Got heaven's gates right here. Got the mountaineer right here. Got the mountains and the clouds behind it. So, you know, I always got West Virginia wherever I'm at, you know? So uh, this is this is why I'm the ultimate mountaineer fan. And uh, even when I was deployed in the military, I, I never missed a football game. I would wake up sometimes at 1 a.m. and I'd be up until 5.30 a.m. and have to have to stay up just so I wouldn't miss a game, you know. I'd be, I'd be in the little public recreational area watching the game, yelling my head off, and everybody's just looking at me. I didn't care who was looking at me, though. Let's go Mountaineers.